When he hears that fire alarm Sam is always cool and calm If you're stuck, give him a shout He'll be there to help you out So move aside, make way For Fireman Sam Cause he's gonna save the day Fireman Sam Cause he's ready to the core Sam is the hero next door If there's trouble, he'll be there Underground or in the air Fireman Sam and all the crew They'll be there to rescue you So move aside, make way For Fireman Sam Cause he's gonna save the day Fireman Sam Cause he's brave to the core Sam is the hero next door Are you sleepy, Dillis? Yes, Sam. I didn't sleep a wink last night. Why is that? Someone's been stealing licorice shoelaces from the shop, and I'm worried sick. Oh, dear. Anyway, you've no need to worry about your fire extinguisher. It's in full working order. <coughs> I'll just check your smoke alarm upstairs. Just a minute, Sam. Turn that racket down, Norman. That's funny. I could have sworn Norman was up here. What's all that noise, then? It's your smoke alarm, Dillis. They make that noise when the batteries are running down. I'll replace them for you, if you like. Oh. <coughs> oh. oh, I think I've got some new ones in the shop. Better get down to Bella's Cafe. Quick, Sam. There's a snowman on the loose. I'll deal with it, Elvis. Sorry, Dillis. Looks like you'll have to change the batteries yourself. Oh! Oh! Hmm? Che pasticcio! Great fires of London! Bella, what's happened? Oh. oh! Oh, Sam, I was polishing the fire extinguisher when a whoosh! She covers me in a white stickiness! Fire extinguishers are best left alone, Bella. Unless there's a fire, of course. <laughs> Oh, the little menace. Ma'am, guess what happened? Don't you come in here, all butter wouldn't melt in your mouth. You've been at the licorice shoelaces again, haven't you? No, ma'am, never. Not me. Don't you fib, Norman Price. But, ma'am! Well, this time I'm going to stop your pocket money until you've paid for all of them. Ah! Ah! Oh, all this worry is wearing me out. Now, what was I supposed to be doing? Oh, what I need is a rest. Oh, oh, oh. Huh. What's up, Norman? Ah, someone's been stealing like a shoelaces, oh. and Mum thinks it's me. She's gonna stop my pocket money. Well, you'll just have to do something about it, won't you, Norman? All right. But what? You could start by finding out who did steal the licorice shoelaces. Great. I can be Sherlock Holmes and you can be my assistant. No, I'll be Sherlock Holmes and you can oh. be my assistant. All right, then. You can be Sherlock Holmes. And I'll have the torch. Hmm. I think it needs batteries. Oh, there's some here. I must have left those batteries downstairs. Never mind, I'll just rest my eyes for a moment. Come on, we've got a thief to catch. Ah! Oh. <laughs> Leading from my man's shop. A licorice thief. <gasps> After them. Ecco, Mike. Spaghetti alla ragù. Oh, 
It's all bollock knees to me, Valor. This looks good. That's my dad! But what's he eating? Licorice shoelaces, that's what. No, it can't be. Give yourself up, Mr. Flood. Your life of crime is over. Oh, Dad, how could you? Uh oh, how could I what? Steal those licorice shoelaces. <laughs> this is spaghetti, Mandy, not licorice. You want a taste? <gasps> I've got a surprise for you, Sam. Shall I give you a clue? They're long, they're red, and... They're stolen! Elvis Cridlington, I arrest you for stealing licorice shoelaces from my mum's shop. I was just showing Sam the new fire hoses. Ah. Oh. Now, if you really want to catch the thief, you're going to have to set a trap for him. <gasps> we put out the licorice laces, then we wait. Leave those shoelaces alone! <coughs> <coughs> My mom. Oh. <laughs> mom. Ah. No, no, man, it's too dangerous. Mom, go and get help. Mom, go and fire my son. Mom. A fire at Dillis's shop. in there. Don't worry, Norman. We'll get her out. Water on, Elvis. We're going in. Help! Save me! I'll get Dillis. You tackle the blaze. Don't worry. I'm coming to get you. Don't worry, Dillis. I've got you. What I don't understand, Dillis, is why the smoke alarm didn't go off. It's my fault, Sam. I was going to change the batteries after I'd had 40 winks. It's no good having a smoke alarm if it doesn't have batteries, Dillis. If you give me the new ones, I'll fit them for you now. Aha! The case of the licorice shoelaces is solved. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you the thief. Oh, I'm sorry, my little precious. I should never have doubted you. That's all right, ma'am. It's hard to believe that Dusty could have eaten all those licorice shoelaces in one night. Fancy a biscuit, Norman? Ah, thanks. Oh! Norman Price, you little menace. So move aside, make way.